Hello everybody, it's episode, wait, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, right? Yeah, 14. Um, I'm Tyrolin, your host, and we are still just sitting in our little piece of Italy here. We haven't done much. I mean, we have increased our uh, territories, but... Uh, abandoned trade post. No. Okay. We uh, apparently, our liege is winning this war, though they did drop some raiders here, and I think they're getting distracted by it. No, they're not. They're coming back in here. Where are the Abbasids? When you... Wow. And I think this is like EU4, where they don't actually take as much attrition as claim. Maybe they do. We'll watch the numbers. I've had a daughter. Uh, they have actually gained troops doing that. 22 monthly attrition. Uh, you're going into jail. Big time jail. Which gives you the possibility of becoming cruel. Wow. Yeah, I don't think they... Oh, yeah, they do. Jeez, that just dropped like crazy. So, yes, yes. Oh, no, they moved another 2,000 troops. Oh, yeah, no, it dropped like crazy. Unless they're assaulting. Yeah. Okay, so maybe they are affected in this game. EU4, they get kind of, uh... Kind of let off. Well, let's see. What else can we do here? would love to do that one, but I can't afford it. Mm. Eh. You know, I really don't want to spend the money right now because I'm really worried about... Oh, who needs to be educated? Oh, my niece does. All right. Okay, yep, you're going to my wife as well. Um didn't see it when I was scouring around in the world. I want to spend it. But I don't think it's worth it right now. Wow, I'm making a lot of money. My stewardship's pretty decent. Um, I'm chased and I'm still pumping out babies. Unfortunately, they are female babies, but how much do we need to do this? 500? Or is it 1,000 now? Uh, he could be brave. He's 5% he dies. Yeah, we'll just let him be brave. So, we get to mold our air. I think this is the first time we've done this. A lot of times, in, in less of a Republic setting, you have more control over this. So. But now he's brave, which gives him two martial uh, at the age of six. Combat skills. All sorts of stuff. Okay. I don't know. Maybe it's a thousand ducats for this. If it, even if it is a thousand ducats. I'm just going to pump this down for right now. Cool. We have now done that. We gain a stewardship for it. We can pick a new ambition to have a son. Because I don't think these guys can be... Yeah, they got zero respect. But women and children can never be elected, so at this point, there's no point to wasting the money. But we could improve our mansion in the process. Mm. Wow, we have enough to actually do another mansion, which is another tax bump. It is currently eight. It'll stay eight. Right? What is it currently? Total bonus. Great mansion. Oh, no. What is it currently, then? Upgrade to palace 3, plus 30, plus 8 at income, plus 3 total trading posts. I think that's added on top. So, we could increase this. You know what? Gotta spend money to make money, right, boys? Let's do this thing. Let's do this thing. Plus, we're not getting it from male heirs due to disease, so we might as well increase this way. And we're making 14 ducats a month. That's pretty damn great. So, can we do this yet? 829. Nope. I would love to change it to Marshall, but... Sloth is killing me. It's base of two. 
Or I had a base of nine here. My marshal sucks. But everything else is pretty decent. Um, you probably need to die. And I have a high enough diplomacy that I could probably get him killed. Okay. Okay, I will figure that out in a second. Let's go into Intrigue and Auto-Invite and see what we get. Who can be betrothed? Oh, okay. Okay. Well, niece got married. Yeah, it's gonna... It's gonna jump up a bit. He joined. I don't think you can, because I married you off, did I not? Yes, I did, so... That might be buggy. There's a lot of people here if you just paid them a little bit. Sending a gift. He's auto-invited. Anybody else with high percentage? Nope. Nope. The ones that... Ooh. Uh, send gift. 20 ducats. That should auto. Pull you in. Oh, maybe not. I sent you money. Oh. There we go. More plot power. There we go. She added now. This should happen anytime soon. I just want to get rid of my rivals. What the f fuck? Of course I died of camp fever! <sighs> My domain's just gonna have to be too big for, too for a while. You gotta be kidding me. We're still gonna make some money, but for fuck's sake, game! Every fucking disease in the book. And now I have no control over who... Alright, 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 alright. Quit your bitching. We need to appoint you. We need to appoint you. You absolutely despise us. You know what? I want you to... Continue to fabricate claims then in that ter hostile, hostile territory. So we are no longer Doge. This is what happens when you're no longer Doge. And you cannot increase because you are the only one. We had no choice. There was nothing that can happen. We died of a disease. So we're going to try to get back on the on the console, council. But uh, as of right now, we can't do shit. And we have the, this Iconoclast army coming at me. That's awesome. And we have this army of... The Sheik here, we are losing bad. Yep, they finally got all their armies together. I'd rather you not loot all my lands, but, uh, okay. We were trying to kill that guy, and then he became Doge. So eventually, we will, uh, try to kill you off. That's right now, we can't do anything about it. Here comes our military. We own all the territory in this land, except for this city. We lost the capital city because of this, but we keep the trade post. Really? He won't end the plot. I can't do anything. You try to siege it, we might lose it. Ugh, this fucking disease! This goddamn disease everywhere. The Me Manichaean faith triumph? The adherents of the Zoroastrian faith have steadily dwindled to the point where Manichaean believers are in the majority. This new state of affairs has reduced the Zoroastrian faith to a de facto heresy. All former. Okay. Okay. I mean, really, at this point, we're just trying to stay above water. We, we are trying to survive until the age of 16 so we can actually do some. And this might end my entire reign right here. We have Typhus. Again. The fucking disease is going to end our game. 
this might end it. If this ends it, we're, we're done. We won't go any further. Um, it will end our game. So, and my kinswoman also has the disease. We will see. See if the game's nice to me or not. My regent is my mother, I believe. No, my, uh, my aunt, technically. Well, we'll see. I have no vassals. Well, let's see if we die. I'm just gonna keep watching this, because we still have typh or camp fever. Yeah, typhus. That's a minus four health. You know how many times we've been hit with that since we started this game? We're only on episode 14, and we're gonna lose because of this? Well, let's we'll see. Not much I can do. Not much I can do. I get no health from my bravery. This is kind of sad, folks. This is really sad right now. We're just going to save up money. I mean, really, that's all we can do. We're going to need to... If we do survive this disease, we're going to need to pump up the money like crazy. So, And we really can't do much. We can't really pick a focus yet. Got to wait till we're old enough. Oh, I'm not being educated at all. Okay, who do I want to have educate me, though? No one's educating me? Uh... Educate me, please? Um... Where are you? You're my regent. You might as well educate me. Can you educate me if you're my regent? I don't see her in the list. Berta. No, I don't. Okay, well, what do we want? Stewardship? Looks like it's you we're going to, buddy. You're the one that's gonna raise us. Hopefully we don't die. <sighs> I have never been in this position before, where I've outright lost everything. And if the uh, Byzantines lose this war with the uh, Georgians, which they're probably going to, and devastate their troops. Um, yeah, this will be... Oh, he's a lunatic! And he has a great pox! That's so cool. Lunatic gives you some of the coolest events. He's not leading any troops. Okay. I did not die from camp fever, so we are still going. They can raise 7,000 troops on their own. Oh, that's right. I could probably raise some retinue, at least. Somebody comes at me. How much is it? Well, we're raising our retinue, because we're actually sitting here, because we lost this city, even though we own all these trade posts. Just in case somebody decides to come after us, we should have a retinue up. And we're going to lose a lot of ducats for this while it's reinforcing. But, but, keyword, but, we're doing all right. Being educated by one of the most bravest military minds on the planet. He's 46, so he can die. Peasant revolt. Really? Yeah, they're screwed. At this point, if we wanted to join any factions, it'd be the best time, because they're losing everything. But there aren't any, and I can't start any! because I'm a kid. Never mind! I couldn't join if I want. Oh, they're sieging our lands. This is the Peasant Revolt. Oh my god. I don't know what Peasant Revolts do if they win. My liege, my network just finds uh, found out oh, it was homosexual. Blackmail him. Give me some money. I don't mind if he's homosexual, but we need money so bad. So bad. France still hasn't... What? Italy, what are you doing up here? I guess we can look at the world right now since we're just kind of waiting on the game to uh, get to age. Uh, Italy's up in Germany. 
Reminds me of my EU4 game where I formed Italy with Venice. I took over all this, plus the the island, and just start, France started eating this way because I was al allied with France. Yes, I know, I cheated. And I ate into Austria and Germany right here. I got all the way up to here, I think. Before I just decided it was boring, I didn't need to do it. Uh, but the goal was to form Italy and to uh, destroy the HRE to get those achievements. Ooh, Ru Rus is here. Uh, India looks about the same, except for there's a lot more fragmentation. Are they being attacked by somebody? No, they're just, uh... They're just rebelling. Uh, maybe, yeah. It's a revolt, yeah. Interesting. And the Abbasids are still pretty strong. Despite the revolts. And we're still in that war. Oh, we're winning again. How the hell are we winning again? We're losing against that. And the Peasant Revolt is pretty much taking my territory. So awesome. It's the Iconoclast Uprising. This is the Peasant Revolt. It's like everything's going to shit. Oh, there's another one. Yep, we are going to lose lands everywhere. Honest. Are they going to let me keep Honest? Because Honest is okay. Gives you diplomacy. Yep, he's going to let me keep Honest. Diplomacy's good. They haven't really taken anything here, though. Or they just took the... I can't do anything against those people. Might as well throw my retinue over here. So it doesn't die. Liberation of Bulgaria. Oh wow. Everybody's just coming after the Byzantines now. Liberation revolt. Bulg oh god, Bulgaria might come free. That's 7,000 troops. Yeah, the Byzantines have seen better days. I don't know where uh, our lieges troops are. I think they are pretty much gone. Because I do not see them on the map anywhere. Unless they're sitting down here somewhere. Which I don't see them. Yeah, this 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 country is pretty effed. It might be able to pull back together, but for right now, this is pretty screwed. But I'm going to play it until either I die, because they can pull me out. Like, I could be hiding in any one of these territories. I, sh I think it's here that I really am, though. <sighs> That's new. Italy took quite a bit around here. Italy's strong again. It used to be all under France, but... Uh, and they actually became France. They're not West France anymore. They actually became France. Italy has little territories all around France. It's kind of crazy. The... Ooh! The Umyads are actually getting really strong. Now, playing as a Muslim is weird. I've played as one. They are not easy. Those decadent revolts, they're, they're there to keep you in check, not to blob. Um, wow, nothing's really happened up here either. Yep, we're losing our territories to the peasant revolts. It's great. Can't do much about it, and we're going to lose money like crazy now. That's why we're uh, saving up money. <sighs> yep. I don't think they can take my trade posts, but they can definitely take my baronies and such. What are you mobilizing for, mister? host. Huh. Okay. Wow, I'm just intrigued on what's going to happen now with all this. I mean, the Byzantine Empire might just crumble underneath this. How did you become over her? I don't understand. Because she was the one with the claim on me, wasn't she? No. She's not here anymore. Is it you? Huh? Oh, I don't know. And educate child. Sure. <laughs> At this point, it doesn't really matter. Yeah, I have no heir to my dynasty. If I die, I die. I'm done. Well, there goes another turn. Please do not let me be slothful. You asshole. And of course, 
Now I'm going to be Slothful. Slothful does you no good. Does you no good. Absolutely not. You know what? We're just going to bump this up one and kind of watch the fireworks. We're going to actually bump it up to full because I want to see what happens. Actually, we're out of time. Never mind. I'm going to save the game here, and we'll see you in the next one. This is Ty Rollins signing off. Bye-bye.